Hey, what's going on, everyone? It is Max Style Kim here, back to you guys with no video. What's good, my dudes? How you guys doing? As you can see, new environment, aka my dorm room, so that's fun. But I'm back in college for my spring semester, aka my last semester of my fresh meat, fresh meat, <laughs> fresh men year of college. And basically, as you can see from the title, New year, not new me. <laughs> Quite honestly, I hope you stick around for this video because there's like a few announcements. If you're a new subscriber or someone who just found my video, watch, watch it through. 2018 was probably the worst year I've ever had on YouTube. I only posted, not two, 11 videos on YouTube in 2018. And if we do our calculations, there are 52 Saturdays. So if I were to post once a week, like I always, was planned to do, I would have 52 uploads in 2018, but I would actually would have more because I would post more in the summertime. That didn't happen, obviously. I only posted 11, which is, which isn't even a third of the actual year. So basically I might as well have posted nothing. So like I said, 2018 was kind of rough. RIP, not cool. I get it. But, but, but I am not necessarily making New Year's resolutions this year because I feel like the word New Year's resolutions kind of pulls me off and takes me away from the actual thought of what a New Year resolution is. At this point in my life, I guess you can say, or at this point, I think of New Year's resolutions and I'm like, well, New Year's resolution, only like 2% of people actually do New Year's resolutions. And I think rather than calling them New Year's resolutions, I'm gonna call them goals. And I know technically New Year's resolutions are goals, but I feel like when you, when you label your goals as resolutions, that's what automatically flickers things off and it kind of makes you think if you don't start it in 2019 in the beginning of the year like new year's day or whatever that if you fail or most likely statistically when you fail you won't continue to reach for that new year's resolution rather with a goal i feel like you are more inclined to actually go and do the goal rather than this is not what i said in the beginning of the month whatever and like, I'm gonna try to do that because it's New Year's resolution. You know, you get what I'm saying? I hope that makes sense. What's going on, everybody? It is Kim here, and I just wanna just, I'm gonna just, it's editing Kim right now, and I just want to note, I felt like this didn't really make any sense. Uh, so I just wanna explain myself a little bit better. So for me, when I think of New Year's resolution, I think, oh, this is for my new year. You know what I mean? New year, new me, all that stuff. And I feel like that's not a good way to go into something when you have a goal, right? Let's say my goal is to upload every single Saturday. If I were to say, oh, I'm going to make that my New Year's resolution, blah, 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 blah. To me, that's thinking, oh, okay, I'm going to post every single Saturday because it's the new year. I'm not thinking I'm going to post every single Saturday because I want to necessarily. And it just shows because people who during the New Year's resolutions era, I guess you can say, People are doing whatever they gotta do for like a month or two, whatever, and then next thing you know, it just, and they're not no longer doing it. And whether that's because they just decided not to do it anymore, or they got lazy, or like whatever it was, they stopped doing it. And like I said in the video, like only 2% of people do it. I wanna set goals so that I can do it, not set goals because they're New Year's resolutions. I just feel like my purpose is like mixed up and I feel like having a purpose of, oh, it's because it's a New Year's resolution makes up the whole, this is, this just makes everything a little worse, <laughs> if that makes any sense. And yeah, so that was kind of what my thing was, but other than that, let's just, let me just get back into the video. So I don't want to call them New Year's resolutions, I do want to, I want to call them goals, and I, if this makes sense to you, how about you guys try it with me? I do have a few goals, which I'm not going to name them all, but the most important ones for you guys, my viewers. I'm gonna try to post every Saturday. Will it actually happen? I don't know, but it's my goal that I'm gonna to continue to try to do, which coincidentally is the start of the new year. I also wanna stream a lot more. I can't stream, physically can't stream in college, so that's gonna to have to be a summer fling kind of thing. I'm not gonna say, and I'm gonna be honest, I probably will not complete every single day because that's just, not my thing. I have other things to do as well. 
but that is my goal so I do want to try to do it that's my mindset for 2019 because especially when I look back on it and I think about it I'm like all these goals that I've accomplished I didn't call them like New Year's resolutions you know I started them whenever I decided that I wanted to make that a goal of mine when I was a freshman in high school I told myself I was going to be senior class president in my senior year of high school I told myself that that's what I was going to do and that's my goal I'm going to be working to get to that goal and I did eventually get to that goal that's just an example of what I'm trying to say to you guys is that it's a goal it was a goal that was started not because it was New Year's but because of myself so I'm going to try to continue to do that but on a brighter note, at the end of last week's video, you saw this. Well, as some of you may know, I don't know if you're a new subscriber or not, but some of you may know that at the end of my videos, I always go, I hope you all had a wonderful, fantastic day. Make sure you stay maxed out and peace out. Haven't already, and I'm talking way too much. But yep, that's it. I hope you all had a wonderful, fantastic day, and I'll see you guys all next time. Stay maxed out, guys. And that's my little slogan. And I recently got a designer because I didn't want to design it myself because I knew I would be not open-minded to new styles and whatnot. And I loved how it came out and I kind of want to make that a brand for myself. And I don't know if it will actually become a brand um, or if I'm just dreaming too hard or what, but that's kind of my next step with this, if you get what I'm saying. But I do want to make more artwork and hopefully eventually open up a store or clothing line if you guys want to like you know buy stuff rep some merch and all that good stuff um but if you're new around here make sure you subscribe like the video turn on post notifications turn on those notifications man you know you want to get up to date on all my videos but other than that guys i hope you all had a wonderful fantastic day make sure you stay maxed out and peace out bye guys